Hi, my name is Sonia Hughes. I'm an epidemiologist with Dallas County Health and Human Services. I would like to give you some important information on West Nile and Zika viruses. West Nile and Zika viruses are diseases most commonly spread by mosquito bites. The mosquitoes that can carry West Nile and Zika viruses are present in Dallas County during mosquito season, which is typically from May to October, but can begin sooner or extend longer based on a number of factors. These mosquitoes can be found indoors and outdoors, as well as during the day and night. The mosquitoes that most commonly spread West Nile and Zika viruses are different. But the thing to remember is to avoid all bites from any mosquito species, since they can all be potentially harmful to your health. The symptoms of West Nile and Zika viruses are not exactly similar. You can get a rash or joint pain with either virus. Additionally, with West Nile, you may have a headache, body aches, vomiting, or diarrhea. And with Zika, you could have a fever or conjunctivitis, which are red eyes, along with a rash and joint pain. If you experience any of these symptoms, see a healthcare provider for an evaluation and diagnosis. There is no specific treatment for West Nile or Zika virus, and there are no vaccines for prevention. The best way to avoid any mosquito virus is to avoid mosquito bites altogether. I'm Zach Thompson, Director of Dallas County Health and Human Services. Everyone should use the four Ds to prevent exposure to mosquitoes. DEET, all day, every day, whenever you're outside, use insect repellent that contains DEET or other EPA approved repellent and follow label instructions. Dress, wear long, loose, light colored clothing outside. Drain, remove all standing water in and around your home. Dust to dawn, limit outdoor activities during dusk and dawn when mosquitoes are most active. To avoid Zika virus, there are extra precautions to take. Travelers should choose a hotel with air conditioning or screens on windows or doors and sleep under a mosquito bed net if you're outside. And while the Zika virus is primarily spread through mosquito bites, it can also be spread by sexual transmission. Sexual partners can protect each other by abstaining from sex or use condoms. Since Zika virus can cause birth defects, pregnant women and women planning to get pregnant should follow all recommendations to avoid mosquito bites and additionally consider postponing travel to areas where Zika virus transmission is active. Those areas include Central and South America and the Caribbean. Be sure to talk to your healthcare provider if you believe you've been exposed to any mosquito virus. Please go to our website for more information, dallascounty.org slash HHS.